he's not flexing as well. And you can even see in his head that his head doesn't wiggle as much when I go this way. When it comes to horses, Dr. Darcy Ward has a special touch that most people don't. But I would not call her horse whisperer. I think it's more a bond than whispering and communicating um, in a telepathic kind of way. Her life centers around helping horses, cats, dogs, and other animals get the pep back in their step. Her job, a very unique one, animal chiropractor. I think it's getting more popular, the words getting out more, what animal chiropractic can do. Uh, I'd say more people who have performance horses are, are more up on how chiropractic can help their animals. Or maybe it's even a behavioral issue. And that kind of goes to the, the dogs and cats. Their behavior starts to change and the owners notice, you know, Fido's not acting right. Or, uh, you know, F Felix is, is not able to jump up on the couch anymore. Boy. On this day, she's working with Sumo, a big fellow who had a rough weekend. He's been limping for the past, I don't know, six weeks or so. Um, after we, uh, we took him out to the farm for a weekend and he romped around with some other dogs and tripped in potholes and, and, uh, ran into a few, uh, metal fences chasing other dogs. To see Darcy work in person puts you in the presence of an amazing experience. I'm here doing that with him. Okay. So firm, good pressure in his shoulder. I was hearing his back crack and, and different things and it, I just... I was sort of just impressed. Like I didn't, I wasn't aware that you could, uh, <laughs> you could do that to a dog. Darcy's connection to animals started very early in her life. As a child, I always felt like my horse got me, and he was, he was the most, uh, the most amazing being out there for me. You know, he. Um, he, I used to call him my savior, you know, I think he kept me busy and kept me away from things that might have tempted me to do other things that I shouldn't have been doing. That connection creates an environment where she can move and manipulate an animal of immense size and power. I think trust is the most important thing for sure. Um, you know, I come out and I'm doing things that they've never had done to them before. I'm wiggling them and moving them and they respond amazingly, you know. It's funny, sometimes when I'm adjusting them, they seem very grateful. They'll, they'll turn and they'll turn their head all the way around and look at me like, what are you doing? <laughs> it's very sweet. The results are very tangible for the owners. Some of it is performance related. I have some barrel racing clients that I work with and they notice that their times are faster. Darcy's biggest issue Pet owners waiting too long. When an animal starts to um, have problems with a disc or a nerve, it seems like it progresses very fast. And so my hope is that people will be more educated about chiropractic and what we can do to help their animals, but not wait. You know, as soon as, as, soon as you see that they're having trouble with their back end or their leg or they can't turn their head, get it get it taken care of right away so that they have a better outcome. Being a miracle to so many fuels Darcy's purpose. When they come to me, it's usually a crisis. It's, you know, you're my last hope. I'm going to have to put my dog down if we can't get him better. And just knowing that I'm able to keep those dogs um, from being put down and maybe even giving that owner a couple of extra years with them, uh, that's really amazing.